guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here i am emmy and i know it has been so so long since i have uploaded a youtube video but i finally have the time now i'm back in school back in my apartment so yeah today today i decided to record a video so today i am going to be talking about my hp laptop i did a short um video and i uploaded it as a short but I have gotten a lot of questions about it on my YouTube and exp and my TikTok. Um, I think I uploaded like three videos of the of this laptop, one on TikTok, and then I think I've uploaded two on my YouTube. So I've gotten a lot of questions about the pins that I use. How do I take notes on here? I've gotten questions like the battery life, what I recommend it, the price, where I got it. I've gotten a lot of comments, and I I think I've replied almost to all everybody that's asked me something about this computer. But today I just decided to do a laptop, and I wanted to go into depth, more into depth on the way I take notes on here, especially for my college students diamonds college i did a little video on my tiktok but it was just kind of a short brief thing so i decided you know why not just go ahead and show you guys the pins that i use and the apps that i in the app that i use to take notes on here and then as i'm explaining that i'm also going to be talking about the battery life some of the stuff that i don't like the pros and cons of this computer um yeah so let's get into it so to begin with i'm going to be talking about the pins that i use because I, I think i get asked about these the most on my tiktok um both of these are on amazon i will put the link in my description and i'll also put the price and everything um in the picture beside me these on amazon were to find them and see if they were compatible to this computer i literally just typed in the model number like the exact number into amazon and then it brought up all the pins that were compatible to this computer to this laptop now i did go through and read all the reviews to both these pins before i got them some people said that it was horrible it didn't work for them some people said that you know it did great no trouble so you just gotta go with gotta go with your guts on that but this is the one that i've used all last year so i've had this one probably like probably like nine months they both run on type 4a batteries really really skinny battery so these are not rechargeable I just put the battery in both of them. And now this other end, I just got this in like probably like three days ago. This one has a lot finer tip than this one. This one has a lot blockier tip, has a lot blockier tip than this one. So, and this one is a lot heavier also than this pen. Um, but so far, I have to say that I do like this one better just because the way it writes and I'll show you guys um, all of that after i get to talk about this um but this so far this is my favorite and they both have the same functions on them they have an erase button you can erase and then one that you can like move your words around on the screen and i'll show you that so yeah these are the two pins that i've been using so yeah now i'm just gonna set up the camera behind me and show you guys how i take my notes and everything also i do not use the case for this anymore because i got tired of taking it in and out of that case so i have to find a case that like i can just snap on the front and back so where i can also fold it like this because most of the cases that come with this like for the two-in-one like it doesn't allow you to like flip the computer or i haven't found one at least so if you guys know of any please let me know in the comments okay but now we're just going to get into how i take my notes on here okay before i get into the notes section of this video i did want to talk about the battery life because i've been asking about the battery i've been asked about battery life i use this computer for about eight hours every single day i will say that i think the battery runs down a little bit fast for me i put it on in sleep mode every single time that i'm done using my laptop because i saw that like my battery life was like going down throughout the day like i have to bring my charger to school with my old mac like i never i never had to bring my charger to school and i was on it just as much as this computer so even though that i put it in sleep mode it still dies down for me quite fast i close down i mean i shut down every tab that i've opened every single time that i've done with it for a class um i don't have like videos running on it consecutively like I don't know. To me, the battery life should last a bit longer. Yes, I have the brightness down all day long. I do have on the battery saver mode. Like, I do everything to conserve my battery. Because, like, I don't feel 
like carrying around a charger like it's just something extra to carry around with me and I don't feel like I need to especially for a $900 computer like I don't want to be carrying around a charger for it so to me the battery down the battery does run, run down quite fast it does charge fast I will give it that it does charge fast um, but it just runs down fast I also got asked about the hinges because I guess someone said in my comments that there's like, I don't know, there's like a callback or something on this laptop. But I haven't had any problems with the hinges, with the, uh, with the screen or anything, with like no blackouts or anything. The only thing is like this part of my screen right here, this part was popping out a little bit. I don't know why. Let's continue to pop it back in. It hasn't popped out in a while, so I don't know what I was doing to make it pop out. Just got this computer. Then I just think I got it this summer. I mean, yeah, it was this summer I got this. Yeah, but other than that, it hasn't caused any issues. Like, the screen hasn't come out. It was only this little corner that was, like, giving me issues. And I just kept popping it back in. And now it hasn't it hasn't done it in a while. So, yeah. Everything else with this computer, I have to say, runs smoothly for me. Tablet mode, I keep it this way every single day, all day. Like, this is how I literally use this computer. Like, I... I hardly use the keyboard keyboard for it. like I take this is how I take notes for all my classes now and I swear that I was not going to be that person that like takes notes on their computer because uh, I'm always a paper notes girl always Cornell notes for every single class no matter what it is I was always a girl but since I've gotten this I have to say that it has changed me and I don't have an iPad or anything like this is all I have I have been taking notes on this since I've gotten it has changed Change the way I take notes, I swear. And I love it. I love it as good as taking paper notes. So, Okay, so now I'm going to get into how I take notes. So I, for this computer, I use the OneNote for Windows 10. So on here, you can add all types of different tabs. Like right here, I have my reminders that I have nothing in. <laughs> um, this is my chemistry tab. So I just can go in here and upload all the PowerPoints. And I can write on them in class as we go. Um, so you have, this is where you add the classes and then in here is where you actually open it up and then this is where you add everything. So like this is my plant soils and sciences class. So over here, this is all the PowerPoints that we've done. And on here you can see I can go through and edit them, write on them, draw on them, whatever I need to do. do whatever I need see this class has a lot of tabs <laughs> okay so I'm just gonna go in my chemistry one and then pick a slide so that I can show you all how I highlight and everything else so we're just gonna use this for an example so you can make this bigger um, smaller zoom it in however much you want I told you guys that I use this computer in tablet mode a lot. So I'm going to be using this pen since this is my favorite pen so far. I love it. I love everything about this pen. So in here, I can go in here and draw. And also this pen is just Bluetooth. So like I literally, I didn't have to connect this pen or anything. All I had to do was put the battery in here. And then from there, it just writes for me. It's not hard to connect at all. So in here, I can go through highlight, pick whatever colors I want, just like you know, with the iPad or anything, go through highlight, whatever, pick a color, write. Erase. There's also this bottom button right here is also an erase button. So if you click it, it'll go through and erase. You can add shapes in here like this. You can color it. Whatever you want. The penmanship on this pen, I said it was a lot better. It's a lot better than this one. So this, I have not used this one since I've gotten this one. Um, that's pretty much it. I mean, you have a ruler in here. You know, if you're just a perfectionist, I do this a lot too. Like when I highlight to make sure that my lines are straight, I do. I use my ruler a lot, and I didn't even use it, but just makes your lines straight. And that's pretty much it. I love it. It keeps my notes organized. It's something simple for me to use. It's not too complicated. Um, it works great for this computer. I mean, it's it's made for this computer. It's very compatible with anything that you want to do. I recommend it to everyone that doesn't have an iPad because a lot of people, some people just don't, you know, want to do the Apple products. Yeah, you can just 
right? Hold on, this pen is so smooth on my computer. And it doesn't scratch my screen. Even though I have a screen protector, it doesn't scratch my screen. Um, so you can also insert. So I'm just going to show an example of how I insert. So right here, like I would just go to add page. And then what I usually do is go to insert right here. And then I go to print out. And then this is some of the stuff that I already have downloaded that are already in my notes. But for example, I'm just going to put this is one of the PDF things that I've downloaded from one of my classes. So I just clicked insert it and then it's going to insert the PowerPoint in there for me. And it's right there. And as soon as it's gone, as soon as it's uploaded on there, I can start writing on it, start highlighting, taking notes, whatever I want to do. And then to delete it, I just hold on it and then just delete that page. Since I don't need it, I just did it for the purpose of this video. And so, yeah. You can insert anything that you want to. I just upload PDFs because that's the only thing that I use. You can insert images. You can edit, edit them on here, uh, pictures, whatever, whatever you want to do. And I'll also link this to my school email, this particular notebook. I connect it to my school email because it's all I use it for. Like I don't have any personal needs that I use it for. But you can use it with your personal email and it works just the same. Okay, so some of this was like a little bright and I don't feel like recording it. So I'm just going to go through and then show you guys some more writing on like some of my slides. Because I don't know, I couldn't adjust the lighting right. But like this is what I was talking about. Like I can just go through and highlight. I think I saw that part like this. I just wanted to show you guys really like how well the pen worked in my opinion. I can just go through it, you know, just write how you would. You know, just on a piece of paper. <laughs> my handwriting is not that great right now. So, like, please don't go based off my handwriting. The pen works great. Pen works great for all. And that's all that I do to take notes for college. Pretty much all that I have for this 2-in-1 HP NV360 laptop. I'm just getting a lot of questions about it on my TikTok and as my YouTube. So I just decided to make a short little video. As I said, I already answered most of you guys' questions in the comments if I didn't go over something that you would like for me to cover. This, I did get this computer at Best Buy. It was $8.99, so I ran that up to $900. I did get the warranty on there. I have not had to use it yet. This is my baby. I love it. I have no complaints. Would not trade her for anything. I would definitely highly recommend this pen. I will just um, link it in my description. Great penmanship. I love everything about it. I know everyone's been wondering about pens because a lot of the pens on Amazon aren't compatible with this computer. So I am recommending this one. I love it. I love it. So um, I hope this video was helpful to anyone in college. And if you're not in college and you're just an adult looking for a great laptop to use to get your work done or to organize your life, I would recommend it. So to all my college students, I hope you... I uh, guys have a wonderful blessed semester. I hope you guys do great this semester and to everyone else. Happy New Year. Happy New Year to everyone. I hope everything is going well for you guys and continue to go well. Thank you for tuning in to this little video that I decided to upload and I will see you guys in my future videos. Have a great day. Bye.